Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. As per the latest report, Indian Army has equipped its frontline soldiers deployed at LSE with 6 SOS 716 assault rifles and Swiss MP9 pistol guns. Both these weapons are battle proven and decent firearms in their categories. Talking about 6 SOS 716, India has procured close to 1.5 lakhs of this assault rifle from US as the deals and negotiations related to AK-203 is still stuck and has not been progressing. At the same time, the threat level at Indian borders has increased with Chinese aggression. Therefore, India has to procure 6716 and interim to better equip its armed forces as compared to its adversary. At LSE, there is a highly unlikely situation of close combat. Both the sides will maintain a good buffer from LSE to de-escalate the situation. This is where 6716 will prove very lethal as it has an effective range of 600 meters. The rifle uses more lethal bullet of 7.62 into 51 mm caliber which is much powerful than the bullets used in AK-203. This round has been designed for shoot to kill purpose. 6716 is a gas operated rotating bolt rifle which can fire 650 rounds per minute. At the same time, Chinese troops are mainly using Type 95 automatic rifle or QBZ-95 which follows an unorthodox bull pup design which is not favorable by most other soldiers especially those who are not used to it. In bull pup design, the action and the magazine are all located behind the trigger group as you can see in the video. Though this design has some of its own advantages such as more compact and maneuverable but soldiers need to get used to its grip and changing of the mags. This is the reason why PLA Army is now moving away from full pump design to a more traditional layout including a maximum forward of the piston grip with its new assault rifle QBZ191. In today's video, we will keep our discussion to QBZ95 as it is the official rifle of People's Liberation Army PLA and its various sub-branches including the People's Liberation Army Navy Marine Corps. The QBZ951 assault rifle fires 5.8 into 42 mm caliber cartridges. The caliber and lethality of this cartridge is definitely less than 6716 cartridge of 7.62 into 51 mm caliber. The QBZ95 has a barrel length of 463 mm or 18.2 inches, which is more than 6716 having a barrel length of 16 inches. The Chinese assault rifle has a range of 400 meters and 6716 has a range of 600 meters. Even though the Chinese barrels are longer than 6716, still it has a lesser range compared to the later. Both the rifles have similar rate of fire of 650 rounds per minute. With better range, high caliber bullets, 6716 is definitely far more lethal than Chinese QBZ-95 which will give Indian Army edge in the border region of LSE as they will have capability to bring down Chinese soldiers at a much greater distance. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.